Hello, this is uh, Rich from Touchboards, and I'm here to tell you about the BoardShare document camera. Uh, I'd like to put this in a little bit of context of what's going on in the world. Today is August 27th, 2020. Currently, there is a shortage of document cameras under $200 caused by the, the COVID virus, or more specifically, people doing remote learning, a whole bunch of schools got out there and purchased document cameras under $200 to give to teachers at home. Uh, and currently, quality brands like Lumens and Elmo are on back order uh, into September, likely October, uh, to fulfill, to get people cameras. And uh, here at Touchboards, we understand there's an urgency right now to get these, uh, this type of equipment in the hands of teachers. So we had board chair overnight us uh, one of these cameras and I'm going to tell you what I've learned about it. So right here is the camera itself. Uh, feature wise, it has this uh, button. You turn off the light, you turn on the light. That's about all the features you got there. Uh, it does plug in with this USB cable here and you go to the board chair website and you download uh, the software. Uh, which is fairly straightforward and simple. Uh, just make sure you pick the document camera, not their interactive whiteboard software uh, at the beginning, and you just download it. You plug it in, you turn on the software, and it works. All that's fairly simple. Uh, as you can see here, and this is a horrible way to demonstrate the quality of a document camera, uh, but I do, here's a picture of my laptop screen, and uh, unfortunately, because I am going fast here, uh, to show this camera to you. Uh, this is kind of the best I'm doing for the moment. We'll come out with a new video in a day or two, but I did want to get something out there for folks. And as you can see, the, you know, the picture quality is not that bad uh, for a $200 document camera. If I did have any complaints with it, and let's see, if, I'm not sure if I can do it again here. Um, it's actually refreshing pretty good. Uh, I, I've noticed that occasionally, the image gets out of focus and, and doesn't readjust itself like it's doing now. When that has happened, I, I just simply go out here and pick a new resolution, just click on that and, and it does readjust itself uh, like that as you see, uh, and comes back in and, and it works fine. Um, but th that would be really my only complaint is that it does occasionally get hung up. Uh, but as you see in this demo, it, it's doing fairly well right now. Um, ha has it match up compared to its comp competition? Well, let's face it, it's doing pretty good. We have these in stock and, and the other guys are back ordered uh, for a couple of more months. So if I was to, if I had my choice between maybe the, the Elmo or the board chair for the same dollars, I, I would go with the uh, Elmo. I, I do believe that this thing's probably about $20 uh, overpriced. It, it should come in for a little bit lower. I believe it's really a, a better price point for this would be under uh, $100, uh, $150. But it will get the job done. Uh, they are in stock. Uh, it is a, board chair is a quality company and you can depend on this camera to get the job done. Thank you.